Hey everyone, John Chow here from JohnChow.com and welcome to the vlog. Uh, I'm here at the San Clemente outlet uh, giving the Tesla a little charge. It's Saturday and that means it's cars and coffee. We're also walking the dog as well. I guess it's a continuation of the daddy daughter day. <laughs> okay. All right, what's what you doing? What's what you, let's go, Sam. Come on, Widget. You know where to go. Take us to Cars and Coffee. Let's go. We're coming to the tail end of Cars and Coffee. It started at 9 o'clock. It is now 10. And it's over 11, so we have less than an hour left. And all right, it, it, it's still pretty busy. Cool. See this, Sally? That's an orange 56 Bel Air. Quite nice. And there's always a plane each with each other. All right, let's check out this Bel Air. Very nice. You need the fuzzy dice, you know. It's not a Bel Air, but fuzzy dice. Daddy, there's a hot dog. Okay, and you need the Oscar Mayer on the, uh, on the antenna. Wow, look at this engine. What can be better than a Bel Air? <laughs> Two Bel Air. This is the uh, the Dodge Club or the RT Challengers. So we have one, two. We have a uh, oh SRTs over there. We got uh, more Challengers, SRTs. Wow, the club is out in force. Seven. Seven of them. Nice. That's what I call a poodle. <laughs> Look, look at this, changing color one, Sally. Yeah, uh, I'm pretty sure that's a wrap, but it's cool. It changes color depending on how you look at it. And you got the little uh, angel eye lights. Porsche 911, Ferrari F430 convertible, and the new white 488, which uh, actually looks quite nice. Uh, the thing, I, the only thing I don't like about the style of the Ferrari, or I don't know what this is a choice, is this door handle. It's right there. It just sticks out like that. It's 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 like a bandage or something. It's not elegant. I don't know why they did it. It'd be much better if they just got rid of it and figured another way to enter the car. Cup a nice hot rod next to a Corvette Z06. Uh, there's always a, a lots of Corvettes here at Cars and Coffee. So go stand next to that truck. See how tall it is compared to you. Uh, that that is a that's lifted. Not only is that lifted, look at the chrome wheels and that thing. The, the tire, the tire is half your height. <laughs> oh my God! Check out these tires. Oh, look at the lip on these tires. That's that is insane. Uh, you know, a lot of chrome. I'm not sure this guy will ever take it off road. You know, he's got these big off road tires. <laughs> All right, check it out. It's the Rivet Mobile. <laughs> yeah, riveted on body panels. I like it. <laughs> it looks well. You know, it's not my taste, but it's cool. I, I, I like the stickers on the tire, so you know he's running Toro R88 hours. Speaking of tall vehicles, check this thing out. Oh my word! Uh, this is the ultimate family excursion vehicle. Look at that. Wow. Look at that. Yeah. Once you get there, I see what it is, Sally. Once you get to the once you get to the point where you can't drive anymore, you take up the bikes. That's how you do it. These tires can go almost over anything though. I'm sure it can, yeah. <laughs> They're made for mountain trails. Uh -huh. Wow, I mean this thing is so big. It, just, it dwarfs this hot rod. <laughs> wow, it's a big customized Ford F-350 with a camper trailer. And look, Sally, he takes up, he takes up two parking spots. So he takes a parking spot on this side and a parking spot over there. It's like, it's a double long. <laughs> yeah, a couple of nice Dodge vintage uh, muscle cars right here. Complete with the Hoosier tires. This is the 440 Magnum motor, and right now here we have the uh, the Roadrunner, the Super the Superbird, or 
What did it? Yeah, Super Bird. Ah, 67 Dodge uh, Charger, I believe. No one's a Super Bird. They won Daytona. <laughs> it's maybe some cars. Yeah. <laughs> yes, right. It's a slightly less rusty version of it. Oh, yeah. We are now at Supercar Road. See, we got an Alfa Romeo. I think that's a C4. A Bentley Continental. Audi R8. Acura NSX, an original. A 360 Modena Ferrari. And we got some other exotic hardware coming up. There's a Pantera, a Tram TR6. And this uh, is a Jaguar. Oh, wow. Really, really old Jaguar. Next to uh, uh, AMG GTR. And the AMG GTR just dwarfs this Jaguar, man. It's like, it makes it look so small. GTR looking quite nice. A, uh, a Ford GT from 2006, um, a McLaren 650S, a Celine Mustang, and a Lamborghini Huracan. Oh, the Lamborghini Huracan was used in the uh, in uh, the, cur the current Netflix series. That uh, was Aventador. No, the they, they, they Aventador was a Huracan, but the Huracan was also used in the uh, in the new Netflix series Fastest Car. And if you wonder how it did, watch the series. You'll see. A uh, vintage Corvette. Porsche Turbo, a vintage Porsche, Ferrari 450 Italia, the last of the natural aspirated V8, Porsche GT3. What? 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 What's that? What's? Oh my God! The dog. Oh, and and a, a beautiful dog. There you go. Say, McLaren 720. McLaren 720 currently my favorite supercar. It's basically McLaren builds cars the way I would build it if I were making a racing car. Very little weight and way too much power. That's how you make a car. And this, what is this? This <laughs> McLaren is not a big car, but whatever is next to it is like tiny compared to it. Oh, it's, oh wow, look at that dog, Sally. <laughs> Magnum PI's Ferrari right here. Along with Magnum PI is still around, he'll be driving that new Ferrari, the 458. But he should drive this one. <laughs> the 308. Oh no, yeah, this is a 328. This is a 328. Hmm? Yeah, let's go get a pretzel. Hey, notice the driving position back then, the uh, classic Italian position is ridiculous. Uh, the steering wheel is angled at an angle at a uh, way that looks like a bus, a bus steering wheel. Yeah, unusual way to drive back then. And since this is Cars and Coffee, this is the coffee part of the Cars and Coffee. See, supplied by Rubies. You can only get coffee, you can get drinks and donuts as well. But, yeah. Supplied by Rubies right there. All right, let's go across the street. Look, Sally, the micro bus. Scooby Doo van. Now we come to the uh, pretzel part of our daddy daughter best day ever day. Yeah, I can go get us some sweet almond pretzel. Every Saturday, Auntie Ann. We love this place. That's what we want. Sweet almond. There's only one. We want two, right? They so they're gonna one. bake. They're gonna bake a fresh one, and then I guess, I guess, uh, Sally will eat that one. What? I eat that one. You have the fresh one. Huh. Sally convinced them to make us two fresh from the oven sweet almond pretzel. Just waiting for right now. Should be waiting about five minutes, and then it's gonna come right off the oven. It's gonna be so good. Yeah. Oh, yum. Fresh out of the oven pretzel. It's so good. Nice and hot and steamy. Mmm. Good. Very good. I see all the cars now leaving cars and coffee. And it's time we leave too. Got this time for the come lunch. We are in the parade of cars leaving cars and coffee. We're behind a, 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 a white hopped up 650 horsepower Z06. Yeah, hey look, a Geo GT40. Those are the owners. They have a handicap uh, sign on their car. What in the world? A GT40 with a handicap sign. That's gotta be a first. I see the Lamborghinis leaving too. I like the Lamborghini Huracan. 
Very nice. You don't have to worry about me about no revving. <laughs> Even if we try to, nothing will happen. I can try to rev, it's not gonna work. We'll just crash into something. Right? Yeah, we'll crash into somebody. <laughs> And don't worry about no burnouts either because um, all wheel drive can't do a burnout on this thing. No speeding? Well, that's another issue. Oh, we can definitely do that. We can definitely speed.